Ah, here we go. All right, cool. Now I can just focus on the chat. Hey, what's up, everybody? Nice to see... Hey, Scottish Geeks Plays! Man, it's been forever since I've heard from you, man. How you been? What's up, Wolf Brother Mythos? Nice to see you here. We'll be starting in just a few moments. Ugh. And for those of you who are watching the archived uh, video after, you know, after the live stream, um, hello and welcome to you as well. You may see me interacting with the people in the chat. Cheers, everybody. I'm having a, um, rum is my favorite alcoholic, uh, libation, and I'm having, um, Sailor Jerry tonight with cream soda. Good mix. Very vanilla. Uh, yeah, I've been pretty busy myself as well, Mr. Uh, Scottish Geek. <clears throat> oh, that's right. I forgot that the chat goes live with the... With the thing, okay. I was one. I thought that was just a Twitch thing, but when you go back and watch an archive live stream, I forgot that it shows the chat in real time, just like Facebook and Twitch now. Good. All right. Well, enough lollygagging. I'm just gonna go ahead and get straight to it. We got a few people here. Uh, it's gonna take us a minute to get started, anyways, because this game has slow load times. All right. So, new game. I am going to go easy because I don't want to deal with permadeath and all of the, uh, if you go, if you go over to custom, you can actually set each of these things individually. Your survival needs, the, uh, you know, penalties for not eating, sleeping, or drinking, the conformity, the awareness level that the enemies have of you, um, whether or not they can tell you're t taking your joy or not, and combat. Oh, Doctor Who references, yeah, because it's British and there's um, there's phone booths and stuff. And then combat as well, of course. So uh, we're just going to go with easy because I don't feel like dealing with all that extra nonsense. I like to enjoy the story. All right. So, oops. Let's just do it, shall we? All right. Since these loading screen uh, loading screens take like five hours, I'm going to uh... ah yeah the Daleks. Yeah. I'm actually not super familiar with Doctor Who and lore and all that. I've never actually watched it, but I know enough from social media and such. This game is split into acts, by the way. We play as different characters throughout, and in the first act, we play as someone named Arthur who works in the newsroom. But, hey, this is a dystopian past game. It's set in kind of the same era as Bioshock, and it's got a very similar aesthetic as well. Um, yeah, I'll have, to, I'll have to go back and watch Doctor Who sometime. It's on my list. I just know that it's, there's so many seasons now. Um, but I'm aware. I'm aware of the references. But uh, everybody's taking their pills, their joy pills, that allow them to see the world in a happy light. And you'll get an example of that right here. Yeah, 50 years. Yeah. That's a lot. All right, so here we are as Arthur. I've played, like, the first 30 minutes of this just so I'd know what I was doing, you know? Wanted to give it a, ch uh, a chance and see. Hey, what's up? Hi, my game is. Martin, how are you doing? So Arthur's oh, job here... No. Arthur's job here is to censor the news. Any news story that is uncomfortable or or sad or upsetting is meant to be censored. You know, that's their job because in this world, everything is supposed to be happy. See, now this is when you're off your joy. Everything is... 
normal looking. Alpha, where are you? Alpha! How did you go? Alpha! Alpha! This guy's passed. What's going on with joy. it? Shouldn't I? I forgot to turn on the subtitles. I'm so sorry. I probably should have done that. Ooh. Ah! No, I don't want that. <laughs> there we go. On. Subtitles on. Sound captions on. Set. Bam. That works for me. The news ticker, when there's something important going on, it'll tick around the bottom of the screen. It'll show stuff. Okay, so... Bam. There's that. And then... I'm going to... Turn down the music and the sound effects. I don't know why I didn't do this uh, already. And leave the dialogue up. Okay. Good. <laughs> that way, me and the game aren't over overpowering each other, and you guys can actually see what the what the subtitles say. Okay. All right. So he's trying to remember something from his past. Taking the joy will make him not remember it. Now, here's a fun little Easter egg. If you take your joy right here, the game ends. Watch this. Right. And you get a trophy. Happiness is a choice. Snug as a bug on a drug, is what the trophy says. I know they're censored, so... Snug as a bug on a drug. And there you have it. That's it. That's We Happy Few. We beat it already. Goodbye, everyone. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. We're going to go back. So anyways... um. Yeah, the, the PS4 camera's built-in mic is is pretty decent. Um, but uh, I wish I could use my good mic with the PS4, but I can't because it reads it as an input and output device at the same time, and it just it catches me too loud no matter how much I turn it down. Okay, so we're going to skip this since we already saw it, and now we're actually going to not take our joy and remember our past. That's right. Swipe those drugs off the... Hugs, not drugs, children. Percy. Percy. Oh, yeah, the, the garbage... What have you been up to? No one's seen you for hours. Oh, nose to the grindstone. You know. Then why haven't I heard a single whoosh through the door since 10 o'clock? Did you forget we're having Deirdre's birthday party? Oh. We've got a pinata. Oh, I'm right. sorry. Brilliant. Dalek. Of course. Have you forgotten your joy? <laughs> of course not. Snug as a bug on a drug. Well, come on then. Finish up. Uh, just have a few more pages. I, I know you're very busy. Then don't take too long to finish. Look at that creepy smile. God, that's... Uh -huh. that's the power cell's empty. Well, what will you do? Well, I guess I'll get a new power cell, won't I? All right, stand up. Do you know walk I over here? Real butter in Pick up. Cake, and that was the last of it. Sit down, and let's... Bam. Okay. All right, so... There is now a curfew in effect at night. This... What are we going to do, Arthur? We're going to you accept this document what? because it's a happy story. One could read that without a ripple in one's teacup. Yes. How does she know? Yeah, how well, do you know what's on my screen? in the conference room presently. Don't dawdle. You don't want to miss uh, the out. Um, wasn't Prudence supposed to be coming back today? I think this one gets censored. I think we can look with that. And don't worry, we won't be doing this for very long. There's only like one, one or two more. And then we get up and go. And this one, I believe, is good news because it tells people to, you know, that the drugs are good for them. That's right, isn't it? Yep, I got a trophy, Employee of the Month. If you get the Employee of the Month trophy, it means that you did that part right. You got them all right. Okay, so now is where things are going to start to get interesting. We're coming up on what is actually my uh, favorite, one of my favorite parts of the, um, 
just a second. I need to make my face cam a little more transparent. Otherwise, I won't be able to see what I'm picking up. That's better. All right, that's better. And just like Bioshock, you can search every crook and nanny, nook and cranny, crab and crevice and place for items. This game is a lot like Bioshock mixed with Dishonored, with some other elements added in. Hit yeah. birth whistle. Business letter. <clears throat> oh look, Miss Bing has written Clive a letter. Dear Mr. Birth Whistle. It is so thoughtful of you to suggest how best to rearrange the department. I am always grateful for suggestions from junior staff of how to best do my job as director. However, I am afraid that it would be uh, destabilizing to swap your office with that of Mr. Hastings. Fortunately, turnover in this department is high. If Prue doesn't return soon, I don't see why you couldn't have her office. In the meantime, I suggest you pop another joy and feel the sun shine on your face, whether you have a window or not. All the best, Victoria being a director. Thank you. You're off All right. the party, aren't you? I'm not supposed to go past this line. I'm not authorized, but guess what? Bam, bam, bam. And this guy, we're going to sit down at his I desk. See what Miss Bing thinks of your work now, Clive. And we're going to do we're going to do his work. Remember that we have not taken our joy, so eventually the effects of the happy world will wear off. And yes, the stream, sorry, I'm, the comments are over there and the game is over here. And then I have to look at you guys when I'm talking to you, even though it's over there. So yes, the, uh, the stream will be, <laughs> the stream will be archived after, uh, it, after the stream is done, it'll take a few hours for it to process, and then it'll show up as a normal video on my channel sometime later tonight. Okay, so farm workers expected to return from Germany. I think that's good Nothing news. Oh, we're supposed to sabotage it, right. We were supposed to sab... There's a trophy that you get for intentionally doing this guy's news wrong. Sabotaging it. But, oh well, since we already started on the one thing, might as well go with it. But I do believe the point to this game is to reveal the conspiracies. Actually, the the PS4 Scottish Geek plays um, Scottish Geek plays the the PS4 uh, camera only does chroma key for green and blue. It doesn't accept red. I do have a green screen that was gifted to me by a friend, uh, mm. but I'm going to. I haven't started using it yet. I need to figure out the best way to go about hanging it up and stuff like that. I will eventually use it, though. And uh, that's it. Okay. So now we're done here. And oh, look, there's joy pills here that we could take, but we're not going to. All right. So now we're coming up on what is my favorite part of the opening. Whatever happened to you, Prudence? Oh, I didn't know you could go in here. I actually... Oh. When every, when everything looks like this, when everything gets like kind of greenish and not and less colorful, gets kind of dull, that's reality. When everything looks like this, when it's all bright and happy and cheerful, that's the effects of the joy pills that you take. You know, you're hallucinating happiness. Uh, nah, we're not gonna do that again. I wanna move on. I am gonna search the waste bin though. Empty. All right, oh, watch this. No. No, leave me alone. I took my joy. I took my joy. No, no, leave me alone. No. Oh, hi, Arthur. I didn't see anything. I did not see a thing. Nope. I didn't see shit. I seem to be a bit behind in our work now that you mention it. Uh... Just quickly scavenge searching everything. Oh, there was a power cell there. Okay, cool. Didn't see that. I hear that those are pretty useful for one reason or another in this game. Hey, what's up, Cunning Ectuck? How are you, man? All right. Ooh. 
<laughs> well, those things are going straight in the trash. Looks like that thing's broke. All right, here it is. This is my favorite part of the opening. This part was in an E3 trailer, and this right here, this is what sold me on this game. This scene right here coming up. You ready? Watch this. There you are. You nearly missed the piñata. It's the most adorable Spanish custom. Uncle Jack did a whole show about it. You smash it until all the sweets come out. Come on, hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Go on, get it, big old black. Reality sucks. You are off your joy. Take who me? me? Oh my lord. He's a downer. Call security. We've got a downer. Time to run for our lives. This game got off. This game started immediately. Like they wasted no time getting straight into it. Okay. Oh no. I see you guys that are leaving by the way. I'm not ignoring you. Thank you for for joining and um and whatnot. We'll definitely see you later. I just didn't want to interrupt that scene. Put that down. I I will be doing I will be doing a live stream of this game. Flame and Nora. Forget him, there's no time. I will be doing a live stream of this game every Thursday night at 7 p.m. Central until we finish it. So this is going to be a weekly thing for those who want to tune in. <laughs> he said, looks like our basement. Is that a reference to the dead rat? Is that why you said that? Oh, the load times in this game, though, I swear. Anyways, though, yeah. So I am playing on easy so that I don't have to deal with the survival elements because I don't really like that kind of thing. And I don't like permadeath either, so I turned that off. I just want to enjoy the story. Um, but the thing is, um, and also because combat in this game, there's a stamina bar and you get fatigued when you attack and stuff. So if your stamina runs out, you can't attack, you can't defend, and that makes combat a little difficult. So I would rather, you know, not have to be super frustrated with that, too. We're actually going to get into a fist fight with someone coming up here soon, so you'll see what I mean. Oh, my God. <laughs> Hurry up. Uh. Uh. The rum is good, though. Yeah, that's because... Um... Okay, so the reason that this feels more polished than what you may have seen last year is because this is actually the full release. Like, this is the full game now. Every version of this that's been out before has been Early Access. And the thing about Early Access is that you're, is that you, you're basically paying to get access to the game early, hence the term Early Access, but it's still in Alpha or Beta at that point. So it's still, you know, full of bugs and other things that they need to iron out and apparently it still is but then eventually you know once they get the game finalized and everything it goes out of early access it get it goes gold it gets a full release and this game's full release was on august 10th i don't count early access as an actual release you know i don't count early access as an actual as an actual release i don't count it to me, it's just like being in a beta or something, you know? So, like, this game oh. made... Christ, I thought of those bastards chase me. They were bridges, weren't they? The this tunnels. game... I'm this game... Sure I'm not in the parade anymore. I don't this even think I'm still in the village. This game may very well end up on my top ten games of the year this year, because even though it technically came out last year or whatever, as I said, I don't count early access, so the official release was last weekend. And that's uh, that's what I count. Got some coins. You know what? Let's just close this behind us. We gotta get somewhere. We gotta get this way. But we can't. I need some bobs and bits of metal to make a lockpick. Yeah, I need to... The circus is coming to town. 
Okay, so we can craft. So this game has Bioshock aesthetic and and era type setting. It has Dishonored stealth, enemy alertness, and stuff like that. And like the waypoint, even the waypoints on the screen showing you where you need to go kind of look like the ones from Dishonored. And it has The Last of Us crafting, which allows you... Um... I need... I need lockpick. There we go. All right. There we go. Three years of the salamander and me getting into constant trouble finally pay off. Bobby pin. Oh, sir. Sovereign. Sovereign. Where's that sovereign? I saw that. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? That, there it is. Money. Shut up, Jack. That's Uncle Jack, the guy from the VR game that you guys saw me play. He He's in control of the news, and he's there to help, um... He's there to make sure that all of the wellies of Wellington Wells are feeling well. <laughs> How high can I count to? I don't know why. What happened to him? Or rather, who? Electra Lock Shocker. You can pick up bodies and drop them, Assassin's Creed style. That's kind of nice. Ugh, or throw them. <laughs> oh, he's gyrating. That's a collectible. Flashback. Half may going to hurt us. No one's going to hurt you, Percy. I, I promise. But, but if they hurt the city, I don't think they'll blow anything else up. Why? Because we surrendered. I hope. Well, what are we going to do, Arthur? We're brothers. I'll look out for. We'll look out for each other. I don't know, I could probably count to 900,999 before I start getting confused by all the zeros and giving up. <laughs> Pneumatic stash. These are like, um, like, item, like stash boxes where you can put stuff, stash stuff from your inventory and retrieve stuff and put it in your inventory. And there should be a, a bunch of these, um, littered throughout the game. Okay. Uh... Power the hatch. Too bad I don't have any other hatches to go to just yet. These are fast travel locations. Once we unlock another one, we'll be able to use these to travel quickly between areas. Now, once we open this door, we're gonna get attacked. I'm gonna hack it with this thing. Oop. Hope I got that back. It's a jump scare. He's gonna come from behind the wall on the left. We've come to the end of our time. Ow! We've come to the end of our time. We've come to the end. That's the first fight I've won since primary school. That was actually That's way easier than the first, first time. Since primary school. Okay. Uh, God, everything is so dark in this place. Ba 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 ba. Press the button. And there's the ladder we need to get out. Now we're gonna go outside, and that's where I left off. And we did it! We got out of the safe house. That's like, that's the basically the first like 20 minutes or so of the game. That's, that's all I played. Now the rest of this, this Bridge. is all Gotta brand new to Bridge. me in the parade district, which I just got chased out of. Brilliant. Ah, the train <coughs> station. If hey, I can get to the train station, I can just the Alexa, how are you doing? Bridge. Glad to see you. Nice and yeah, I called... I called, called that jump scare days, because... I remember where things were. I played the first... I played, like, the that, that scene already when I tested this game. All right, so that's where we need to go. That's where our main objective is, but that doesn't mean that we can't have some fun traveling the open world. I think this might be the one Sally and me tried to blow up. Cloth scrap. Sure, I'll take it. What happened to the letters? It's for crafting. Of smoke. Hello? Nothing here. I see a... Oh. There was a fence in my way. I'm sorry. Weapons will break after repeated use. Ugh. I hate that. Uh, it also upsets people when you carry them around openly. Well, so, 
Ah, uh, okay. So I can just put it in my magical video game pocket so no one is the wiser. Very good. Eh, eh. Up the ladder we go. Oh, wow, yeah. 10 likes already? I didn't even notice that. That's a uh, dig spot. Oh. Rotten apple, I think I'm good on that. Dart, I dart, and dart. I hope uh, this doesn't give me food poisoning. It probably will. Don't eat it. I didn't mean to pick it up. Oh, can we just sit here and enjoy the view? Oh, it's Assassin's Creed style stealth, just like sitting on the bench in between a couple people. Ah, <laughs> Oh, and you can wait, too. Interesting. As you can see by the 0% under the pillage, we are totally and completely off of our joy right now. So we are completely joyless. Now, we can take joy in order to trick the wellies into thinking that, you know, we're not a downer. But we've already been labeled one, so... What? Are you... What are you watching from two different accounts? Blue 82 fan and Becky Grove? What is this? Or did something happen with your other one? Hey, yeah! I heard that this game can range anywhere from like 7 to 20 hours depending on how much bumfuckery you do and, you know, how distracted you get. And... You, I haven't got it all figured out, but I will find you. Yes. What the hell is this Mad Hatter nonsense right here? Somebody was having a tea party with bronze statues? It's a little different. Oh, yeah, okay. And half a mannequin. Not creepy. Not at all. Pick that up. I'll get to reading those in a moment. I don't know how much people really care about that stuff, so... Hey! Yeah, we'll get that. Ooh, metal bits. I'll take them. When will they stop crying? Area's a little creepy with the music box and such. Ooh. There's a lot of scavenging to be had in this game. Oh. Oh. A crib. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. When was the last time there was a baby in Wellington Wells? What? But how do you procreate? If no one's allowed to have babies, then the population would eventually just die. Bobby pin. That creepy music box. Oh, there it is. Stop. Thank you. I know it's part of the atmosphere, but it was more annoying than anything. Well, hello there. This is actually kind of depressing. It's like you know that there used to be children here, and now, no children. I have a theory. I already have a theory, considering the the burned downness of this house and everything. I feel like this used to be a normal society, normal people, not hopped up on drugs, not part of some grand conspiracy, but something happened, something bad happened, and like some major catastrophe or something, and it caused the powers that be or the higher ups to be like, all right, that's it, everyone's on drugs now, can't be having this bad stuff. Seems... Thank you. My uncle bought it for me last Christmas. Anxious to get back home to the village. Well, uh, well, I live in the parade. <laughs> you won't get past that door. Not without one of them disposable electrical cars that all the Bobbies have. And a power cell. I have a power cell. Oh, mugger Bobby? <laughs> You're a brave one, aren't you? No. I'll trade you one. Don't you want to go back home? Home to all those bastards who chased me out of my house. When they all catch the plague and die, then I'll go back. There's something I want a whole lot more. Those bastards in that camp over there, with the helmets and the proper weapons. They took something from yeah, me. Yeah, I'm sorry. This game doesn't. Me. This I'll game doesn't really have a good Sounds spot dangerous. for the face cam. Because it's bloody dangerous. That's why I'm paying you. Come and find me in that sort of hamlet over there. We'll trade. All right. Oh, okay. Well, what are they? Me medals. From the war. I won the DSO at Dunkirk. And the Victoria Cross at Ramsgate. Those Dunkirk, huh? Bastards. They thought it was funny that I still had them. Fucking funny they thought it was. 
No. I only need a power cell to fire this thing up. Who'd can store most of those too? Yeah, what? that's fine, but what do you what? want for the I'll see key what card? I, can do. I have well, the... If I go to a camp of robbers, maybe I can defeat them with my rapier sharp wit. Where did he go? Where did he go? He was literally just there. I thought the NPCs were all... Oh. I could have lockpicked that door, but what's the point? The window's open. Ooh, chest. I'll search that. I'll take that duct tape, pocket expansion kit, dart, and dig spot. If it makes you feel any better, I had to turn the transparency down because I can see my own face cam on the screen when I live stream because of the way it works on PS4. So I had to turn it down so that I could see what I was doing. There's not a good spot for the face cam on here because look, at the top left is your health and sleep, at the bottom right is your inventory, and at the top right is your objective. So the bottom left is the only part that's not always filled. It only happens when you search for things. I have a power... I, didn't I have a power... I grabbed a power cell before I... Uh... Ooh, search payphone. Oh. Uh, requires... Jimmy Bar. Okay. So, now we need to find... Now we need to find a Bobby to mug or something, huh? Bobby is British for police. <laughs> Anyways... Heaven's alive. It's a bloody fortress. Is it though? Head boys. I look pretty well buttoned up. I Do not I open. Here till they throw a party for the whole neighborhood. Oh. Find a cleverer way in. Trespassing, you say? So I need to be sneaky, sneaky. Am I gonna have to smack a bitch? Cause I will. Hit yeah. There we are. Ooh. I'm not getting up that way. Too much barbed wire. <gasps> Must find an alternative route. I must sneakulate my way in here. Yup. Yeah. So this... This game has elements of Bioshock, Dishonored, The Last of Us, and Assassin's oh. Creed. What a mixed bag of goodies you got going on there, huh? How the hell do I get in here? Can I just... Nope, that didn't work. <laughs> Probably damaged my shovel really bad, too. Uh, let's see. Oh, hey, what's up, uh... What's up, uh, Nilo... I keep forgetting how to say it. Is it Nalio or Nilo? I can't remember. Anyways, what's up, Jason? <laughs> how the hell do I get in here? Do I just climb the wall? I must scale it! Like Batman. No, I get the feeling that I do need to climb in there, but it's probably... Yeah. Mm. It's the thing that sucks about, um... It's the thing that sucks about, uh... Oh? 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 Maybe? Sure, we'll just clip through the scenery. That works. Come on! Damn it. <laughs> uh, the game caught on to my foolishness. Is there, like, an underground entrance? Oh, I'm gonna die if I fall out. <laughs> oh, here we go. Heal thyself. Oh. Uh. Well, this is where I need to go. I was right. There is an underground entrance. Learned that from Assassin's Creed. When all else fails, try to go from below. I'm low on health, though. I need to fix that. What are the darts for? Are they like projectiles? You can throw at people? They are! How nifty. I need That's to... Awful. I know, it's pro it probably gross. How the hell do you heal yourself? There's actually... Where's my quests? Tracking a quest. There we go. Heal thyself. I could okay, healing balm out of ah something petals okay, because I don't know if I want to go in there when I'm so low on health. Thankfully, I have permadeath turned off, but still, eh, I guess we'll find out. Oh boy, another uh, fourteen-year loading screen. 
Ah, the good thing of oh, well, that one was actually fast. Okay, I'm trespassing. So I loved this. If I could never get in here. He even puts his hands in front of him when he's sneaking, just like Dishonored. This game was clearly inspired by a lot of things. And it's even got the Skyrim. It's even got the whole Skyrim thing where if you uh, loot items from someone else's property, it's considered stealing. Okay. How about you calm down? I guess I have to take that elevator. I hope no one notices. Oh, people are definitely going to notice. We're going to be in all kinds of trouble. <sighs> okay. Oh. Wow. I would not trust the elevator. Oh, God. Oh. Uh, lovely day, Fred. A lovely day it is. Not many people get this far. It's sort of a test. Someone who gets this far usually puts up a decent fight. Okay. In the arena. I don't suppose there's some way I could be more useful to you. That alive. didn't work. I that didn't know. work. Can you juggle? Well, I could write a lovely poem. I won a prize in school. Nah. We've already got a bad. First, put your things in that box. I will leave you there to starve. Um, what, what box? Oh. Aw, oh, I don't want to, though. That sounds bad. Gird thy loins for the moment of truth, for it is upon you. Yeah. King of nothing. I'm just a guy. Okay, um. We need, um. Okay. Okay, time to fight, right? Danny Defoe? Are you related? Are you related to Willem Defoe by any chance? I don't think I know you. Of or, course you know me. You got me sent from the old current. Or uh, will I am Defoe? I, I don't remember that. I, I don't work there anymore. You thought one of my articles was insufficiently original. Danny Defoe? You, you've lost a bit of weight. To be fair, you did copy my piece line by line. Get that was a reference for the latest anything. Bloodborne and episode for those that you who have seen it. Good. Nobody remembers what they read. I don't want to fight you. The feeling is muted. There's only enough food for the winners, see? Now let's change your weapons. Cunning X-Duck, apparently you haven't Why seen... The um... We'll just give the other chaps some bad dreams. Up to you. Ooh, that padded one doesn't look nearly as effective. How badly do I not want to kill good old Danny? Padded weapons will knock people out but not kill them. Well, I don't want to kill Danny. He seems like a decent fellow, sort of. There might be some people I want to kill, but not him. So let's just go with that. All right, um, let's go. Danny's picked the lethal one. That's cheery. Okay, maybe I should have too then. Some guy. I've got great odds on you. Don't fuck it up. He's I'll try. Strong that lead pipe. You gotta wanna block that. I'll try. Still a glorified tutorial, huh? Ooh, that was good timing. Yeah, Ugh, smack you around, punk. Come at me again with that attack. Let's do it. I basically just stunned him. Oh, I see what I'm supposed to do. I wasn't reading the objective. Oh, ow. Oh, okay. Okay, now I can beat him. 
Bam! Smack! Whack and dingle! Come on. Ugh. Right, so I gotta, I gotta hit somebody. I gotta throw him. him. Oh, afraid to find a <laughs> girl. Yeah, take it really easy on us. Oh, oh ow! <laughs> oh, this is gonna be rough. Thank you. Now, can I get out of here? I wonder if sleeping can help restore your health. Oh, I'm not. Okay, I'm supposed to get back on the elevator. Okay. All right. Peace out, guys. It was fun, but I'm done with that. Okay. Goodbye. <laughs> yeah, I say all kinds of weird stuff, but yeah, cunning X Duck. What I was trying to say is if. If you don't if you don't get the will I am Defoe reference then you haven't seen my latest episode of Bloodborne which you absolutely should because Funky Hurdles did a fantastic job editing it just like the last time a absolute must watch If you enjoy laughing it's a must watch Okay I've got a sinking feeling Yep <laughs> Wow that was corny oh, I've got a sinking feeling then falls Oh god this on Oh god what, their corpses? Yeah. It's kind of what happens when people die. In a dystopian past. I bet you if I was on my joy, they would look like soft, sweet teddy bears. Or something similar like that. I wonder, though, do the bobbies also take joy? Or do they see the world as it really is? That's an interesting question. Maybe not everyone is, um... Ooh, yes, a jimmy bar. I need that. What else? Okay. Sinking feeling. Now, how the hell do I get out of here? Rotten potato. The Jimmy bar is probably going to be useful for me escaping from this place. It's got to be this way. Um. Ah, there we go. There we go. First first person platforming. Aha, yes. That's I thank you. I needed that. Where's my inventory? Oh wait, it's right here. There's some sort of vent. I wonder if I can pry it loose. I'd need a jimmy bar. You I got it. I just happened to have a jimmy bar actually. Yay! I suppose now that no one is actively trying to kill me, I ought to be on the lookout for a Motiline dispenser. Chap of the... Joy is real. It's called ecstasy. Um, and no, probably not. I like being happy, but I also like having my... Oh, purchase the sweet dream skill. Where is that at? Ah, here it is. Quietly choke people unconscious from behind, smother them unconscious in their beds. Sounds I good. I suppose now that no one is actively... I better figure out how to get rid of him real quiet, like. I, definitely I will. I want a crowd. <gasps> it's better this way. It's better this way. Okay. And, uh, ooh, can I? Yeah. There. Have a vent. And he had nothing. Uh, drink from the tap? Nah. Was medicine cabinet? Oh yeah, I'll take all that. Thank you. I know I'm stealing. I know I am. I'm not searching the toilet. That's gross. Press circle to sneak. While sneaking, your visibility is lowered. You make less noise, just like Skyrim and Dishonored. Nothing new. Ah, uh, ooh. Okay. 
Now here's where all these first person horror games where you have to stealth around enemies because you can't fight back comes in handy. Yes, you can fight back on here. You can definitely fight back here. But I want to be stealthy. I want to be stealthy. Where'd he go? Ah, there. Yeah, like you didn't see me out of the corner of your eye. Your depth perception sucks. But then again, NPCs, they always do. Uh, oh, there's more of them up there. Here, I'm just gonna drop you right here, and then everyone, will, oh, nope, that's not what I wanted. It's not what I wanted. I'm just gonna put you right here, and everyone will think you're having a nice nap. Sort of. Uh, they're probably. I'm probably gonna regret stealing all this stuff. They're gonna come after Locked. me so hard. Aha! Uh -huh. But I remember how to make a lockpick. Yeah, and I have some made already. Fancy that. So far, I've been taking the non-lethal route to this, but I can honestly say I don't think that's gonna stick. This will probably attract attention. Oh, it's Uncle Jack. Go to bed with Jack. Good morning with Uncle Jack and go to, or wakey wakey with Jack and good night with Jack. Okay. Um, yeah, that's just gonna make noise. And, ooh. Ah, uh, fill inventory, blah, blah, blah. Activate the quick slot, yada, yada. Yeah, I know how that works. And I know, glass bottles you can be thrown to attract enemies. You're not telling me anything that's not already part of another game, trust me. Ooh. Oh, he's got a headlamp? Ooh, I don't know. Oh, shh. All right, there we go. Sneaky now. Oh, just relax. Don't and there's Williams Drysdale. Oh, shit! I almost got caught right then and there. How did he not see me? Consider myself lucky there. Uh, you see that triangle? That means he heard me. He heard noise, and now he's gonna get up and investigate. Just like Dishonored. All right. Oh, no, you didn't. You didn't see anything. How do I get those glass bottles in my... In my thing. Let's see. Outfit, survival, no, no, no. Oh, there we go. Where's the regular glass bottle? Oh, there it is. I want to... Ah, uh, it doesn't give me the option to... It doesn't give me the option to... I think I... Okay, I think I figured it out. I think... Eh, it's not going to let me. That's okay. I'm going to use this dart to get his attention instead. Ha, ah, that hurt, didn't it? Do you, though? How certain are you? Where did that dart come from? Maybe you want to investigate that location. I couldn't figure out how to put the glass bottles in my inventory. Otherwise, I would have. Or my, 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 my quick thing, I mean. I think I will. Oh, shit. Doing. I should have just did that in the first place. Oh, 
let's see. What have we in here? Oh, good. Bobby pins, glass bottles. It didn't auto pick the glass bottle, though, because that's... That's an antiseptic, which it won't let me use because I don't need it. I don't know how to get it into my, uh... Into my quick slot. Let's see. We have electricity here. Exit. Oh, that's the way to go, I think. Or at least that's an easy way out. I want to see what's in here, though. You gotta scavenge for items in games like this. Anyone in here? No, but I need this. These are the war medals I need. Well, I guess I can go to that hamlet and give that chap his medals, and he'll give me the card I need to cross the bridge. All right. Now I just need that power cell. I swear I had a power cell, though, from the beginning of the game when I was running, I guess. Oh, right. They made me relinquish my inventory in that chest. That's right. That's why I don't have one. Now I do. I think that's everything I had when they jumped me. But I still don't have my power cell? I swear to God I picked one up in the be- Wait, Oh, whatever. I can't leave yet. I don't have the power cells for the bridge. You're right. I don't, and I can't. So where does one find a power cell in this hellhole, eh? Can't get in there. So I guess we'll just have to do a little bit of investor negating. I'm assuming the power cell's in here. Oh, there it is. I'm so blind. It's right here. Motiline. Pure resublimated dimotiline. Alright, let's go. Not bad for our first mission. Not bad at all. Okay. If I crouch, I bet I can disappear into those bushes. Just like... Wait. You know what I'm going to say, don't you? Yep, that's right. Assassin's Creed! Okay. Enemies don't spot you if you're sneaking in the grass. The tall grass. Where you can be concealated. But where... Oh. Hello there, fella. The only thing I'm missing is the ability to whistle to draw their attention. Sorry to bother. He's got blood on his head. Not as oh, crap. To get Violence out! Jeez. Who's there? Who hit me? Oh, oh, hi. I love how they word that. Violence and murder. It's for knocking down my blocks in kindergarten. Violence and murder upset people, making them violent and murderous. Sorry. I don't like. I don't like what you're doing, so I'm gonna do it too. Not making much sense, but all right. Probably a side effect of the joy, honestly. Uh, I'm playing on easy. I don't know what I'm afraid of. I'll take that lockpick, though. Look, I couldn't play Dishonored fully stealthily or non-lethal either. You know? Like, I tried, and then it just became too difficult, and I was like, screw it, I'm killing everything. <laughs> oh. Here I was thinking I could just break the chain off like other action games. Goodbye, gentlemen. Hope to see you again never. Peace. I gotta get Mr. Livingstone his medals back, you see. Which will allow him to... Allow us to... Entry permitted. He's not where he was when we met him before. He's all the way over here in the middle of Rundown, Torndown Village. I bet you if I was on Joy, this whole place would look like brand new mansions and stuff. I bet you that's what would happen. Um. Was I in this house before? I was not. Ooh. Uh, I have a Jimmy bar. That makes noise. Yeah, whenever you do something that makes noise, a little speaker icon shows up to show you that you're making noise. Oh, they don't like that I had my weapon out. Oops. <laughs> I forgot about that. It occurs to me that the locals may not be all that welcoming. Oh dear, let's try not to get killed, shall we? 
Sure. I mean, we could always just find some joy and take it real quick so that we don't draw attention to ourselves, but I don't have any, and I don't know where to get it. I mean, there should uh, be a... S hello? Anyone out there? That guy, are that statue... You dress like one. Shit. Slumming it, are we? Must be nice to have a closet. Over here. Over oh, boy. Here. You want to get thrashed? <laughs> that is some Night of the Living Come Dead in. stuff right there. Come in. I'm in. God, you're new here, aren't you? From the parade? Yes. Well, I... How could you tell? <laughs> yeah. I'll tell you how to survive your next five minutes, and in return, you'll give me your socks. My socks? Outrageous. Your funeral. Why are they so angry? Because that suit you're wearing reminds them of all the jolly, proper, decent wellies who drove them out of the homes in the village. And now we're oh. all cold and tired and starving to death. Oh. You better get a nice sharp rock and rip that to shreds. These My people gave this to me for Christmas. Or they'll rip you to shreds. Shit. I hadn't thought there would be so many. These yeah, people like the in this town movie nightclub, isn't it? Are, people get are a bad not on joy. joy. And it like flips a switch. And they can't take joy anymore. So they get chased out of the village. Been a lot of bad batches lately. Oh! Someone happens to rip up my suit. They invite me over for tea and biscuits. Then they really won't give a damn what you do. So long as you don't take things that don't belong to you. Or go up and punch someone in the nose. Which you can do! You can survive the next five minutes. Cheerio! Craft a torn suit. Okay. Uh, craft a torn suit. Craft, 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 craft. Uh, let's see. I need torn suit. Ba bam! Got it. I don't think my suit is decent anymore. I could wear it around the garden district, but proper folk will have me pegged for a wastrel. So as long as you don't steal, which I'm about to do, probably. As long as you don't steal and don't hit anyone don't incite violence, you should be okay. Well, if it was stealing, it would be red, just like Skyrim, so that much I can be able to tell the difference. Dad. Good to know. Hello. Beryl, your name Hello. is Beryl Hello. Marco, Hello. huh? Take down? Right even on. even friendly NPCs you, you can down. attack? Have a cup of tea and I'll just it is like Skyrim, so that's like six or seven different games that this game is a mixture of, honestly. I want a rock. I like rocks. Give me all the rocks. Oh, I'm carrying too many. Okay. I will take that oh, because I'm probably... Vanilla. You know it doesn't work for you. Huh? Oh, could you oh hey! I got your medals. I got your medals? <laughs> yeah, that's what I said. Thank you. You don't know what these mean to me. To know that no, some of us fall. To, to know that I fought. You're probably that. too young to remember. Wish the time those days. In 42, we threw them back in the sea. And they came back in 43. Let me read the comments here real quick. I hate to be a bother, but the card to get across the bridge? Right. Oh, of course, yeah, sorry. Forgive an old man his memories. Well, good luck. I've got this key card, and I can power up the gate with the power cell. This is, this game bridge. is set in like 1964 or something like that. It's an alternate past where the um, the Germans oh, won the war. Safe. I suppose if there's something valuable in this house, it ought to be in here. Yeah, but would I be stealing if I do that? You can hide under beds too. That's nice. So you don't have to fight. I think since these guys, since these things aren't red, um, this is not considered stealing so do we need rest yet we do not need rest yet our sleep meter is at a hundred percent all right we're good open hello any items worth taking in here you have picked up a book back in 1964 people read books to learn how to do things better you should read all the books you can find in wellington wells okay wait is that like uh Is it an inventory item or an actual pick up and read item? 
I do not see it in my inventory here. So, I'm going to assume it's a readable document. Okay, I'm not, my suit, I'm, I'm not, please don't attack me. Okay, I'm wearing a torn suit. Look, I'm battered and ragged just like you guys. White outline is awareness. As it goes up, NPCs become aware. Red outline is suspicion. Ah, another Assassin's Creed thing. This game, this game feels super familiar, even though I've never played it, because it's made up of parts of all the other games I've played. Travel to the train station. Good day to you folks. So these people all got a bad batch of joy, and it did something to them. It screwed them up so bad that they can no longer take joy. It doesn't work for them. So they've been outcasted to this runny, uh, run-down, crummy village. Oh, hi. Anto oh, don't worry, I'm not going to... Oh, shit, I didn't mean to... I didn't know I was going to do that. Uh, I just wanted to talk to you. I wasn't trying to trespass. Lesson learned. Don't walk in anyone's house uninvited. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't want to mess up like that. Are you really going to leave your village to come after me? Put your fists down, dude. We ain't trying to fight. We don't want to fight them. Ah, we're good. We got away. A water pump. Nice. There's a few oh. more in the garden district, aren't there? Well, to fill up a canteen or two, shouldn't I? I don't have a canteen. Wait, is there a canteen around here? I can, is... Normally when they do this kind of thing, it's because there's a... Oh. Bother. Well, she had one. Sounds about right. I ought to be pretty clean. I'm also like gonna... In a village where they spike it with joy. Take a drink from it. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah, they spiked the water with joy in some of those villages. All right, now I can get back to where I need to go. This is where I uh, put in the power cell. And swipe the key card. And boom, home free. How about them apples, eh? Bloody hell, I've forgotten about the revolvers. If I go through without taking my joy, I'm going to get spanked. I better oh. run like hell when it lets me out. Oh dear. Oh dear what? Uh oh. I broke the machine. One bridge down, and I'm off to the train station. Let's get to the train! We'll Man, I really... Later. I really need to upgrade my, my stamina. Oh. What's this now? Welcome to Sleepy Hollow. Oh, oh there's joy. Is there joy in the air? Or am I having flashbacks? This is where we hang them, isn't it? They broke I... into the police station, tried to burn the register so the Germans wouldn't know which kids to take. We didn't want the Germans to be angry, did we? We were so scared, or maybe just so tired, so we hanged them to encourage the others. I wonder if we'd made the Germans take the kids by force instead of bringing them down to the station singing London Bridge if things would be different now. <laughs> oh. <coughs> e. Are you having withdrawals from not taking your joy? Thing I remember. Says the chap heading to the train <laughs> station. If you can't oh, figure out why people are angry with you. There. Okay. Status status screen. Uh encumbrance, rested, increased attack, injured, minor damage taking. Increased attack, decreased stamina drain. Let's see. Needs, fatigue, hunger, thirst. Uh, no need for that right now. We're playing on easy. Vitals are good. Attributes, encumbrance. Oh, 32 out of 100. That's a pretty good, uh, it's actually a pretty good inventory. 100? That's pretty decent, actually. At least I can get on the train tracks there and get the hell out of town. I, I imagine, to oh, excuse me. Station. Imagine I can I upgrade that eventually as well. Hello, everyone. You're not angry with me, are you? Have you been sleeping all right? The worst of it is... We did things the Germans didn't even ask us to do. You... You look exactly like the chick that was in the... In the other building I was just in. Like, that's a... It's a bit of a... Lazy NPC copy-paste job there. Good day to you fine folks. How are you doing? We are the hollow men. We are the stuffed men. 
Okay. But wait, which is it? Are you hollow or are you stuffed? Because you can't be both. We could see everything as it is. Infinite. Her name is Imogen Pickles. I have to talk to her because of that reason alone. This too shall pass, I suppose. It's best not to fight if you can help it. Shut them away and just run as fast as you can. Now look, it's Elizabeth from Bioshock Infinite in her later years. I'm so sorry. That would actually be possible, by the way, because this is 1962 and Bioshock Infinite is, uh, like 1932, I want to say. It's always darkest before the dawn. The Man, these poor people. Real life sucks in this game. It almost makes me want to find some joy and take it so things can be pretty again. Oh. Load screen, why? Now entering Eel Pie Home. Eel Pie does not sound scrumptious. Act like everyone else and they'll like you more. Okay. If you do stupid, suspicious things, another Assassin's Creed thing, you draw the attention of people. Oh, you must be related to the other Pickles person. Wait, is your last name also? No. Been a while, hasn't it? If you find fresh food, don't try to hoard it. The blight turns things rotten sooner than you think. Yeah, I'll probably get sick or catch the plague or something. There's actually a trophy in this game for catching the plague and then curing it. There's also a trophy for killing someone named Ryan Andrews, and the trophy is called, um, um, Shocking, Shocking Biology. I'm sure you know what that's a reference to. I don't want to give it away, though, because I don't want to spoil it for anyone who hasn't actually played Bioshock, but... Played or watched, I should say. Ooh, the rubbish bin. Filled with, you know, rubbish. And useful items. I'm sure digging through garbage... Well, I would say digging through garbage probably is not a very socially acceptable thing to do, but considering this rundown ruckus that we're in, I think people around here probably dig through garbage a lot, just looking for food and stuff, so... That's probably nothing... I, we're fitting right in. Tattered rags, digging through the garbage. And here we are. Nobody's the wiser. Not quite as grand as it used to be. Of no, course, not anymore. Been a train since the germs left. Yeah. Still, the tracks go from here all the way to the bridge, and then across the river. And I don't know if I'm Britain. supposed to be in here or not, but I'm just trying to Hardly see. Crew made it this far. I wonder hmm. why Mr. Kite sent her to the Garden District at all. She this could place have just is over the bridge from the station at Apple Hole. This place is fortified for some reason. Place yourself, Arthur. Yeah, yeah, pace yourself. Don't run for more than five seconds. You might get winded <laughs> because video game stamina always sucks. I hated that in Outlast 2 as well. Hopefully I can upgrade that crap eventually. Let's not go inside other people's houses again. Learned our lesson last time. I know that's where I'm supposed to go right there, but give me a second. I just want to see. Oh. Yeah. Ooh, hello. This is the well of Wellington Wells. <laughs> yeah, it's all boarded up and useless. All right, let's go. I know some of you would probably be a lot more explorative in this game. You'd, you'd search like every little blade of grass that you come across, but I'm trying to be a little bit more pushing the story forward so people don't get Will bored. You shut it? I'm trying not to blow myself up. Hey, look up your bore bags. I'll piss in your corpses. Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> We're coming for you, you greedy bastard! Oh, that was like Looney Tunes Don't right there. It's a banger, you he said. Scanner. Flunk. <laughs> You're done. Hoarding all the bee meat. Oh, now I'm trespassing. Okay, cool. No, I said okay, cool, not okay, Google. Shut up, phone. Speaking of which, why do I have messages? Oh, okay. Ooh, no, you don't. You don't see me. You can't see me. Mm. 
Hello there, laddie. How about I throw this dart over yonder way? Eh. Nope, that didn't work. Man, I thought they were gonna make noise. Oh, it did, it did. It made noise. Good. Oh, help, crap. Bloody help, are you? So get out. Oh, oh, shit. Ah. Now I went and done it. Alright, you know what? Screw this, I'm out. This is a bad spot to be in. I need, uh... I need to heal. I need a healing. There we go. What are you doing? What are you gonna... You gonna throw something at me? Apparently you are. Alright, let's... Ow! Okay. Are you throwing rocks at me? That is rude. Dude, that guy just totally hit his friend trying to hit me. Okay, this this is bad. Uh, yeah. Uh, I'm outnumbered. This is not gonna work. <laughs> I just totally clonked him. I love it. I love sound effects like that. Bonk. <laughs> uh, I'm having too much fun with this. Bonk. Come on. Oh, shit. Bonk. Oh, you are dying from wounds. You need to heal yourself quickly. Uh, up in my pressure. Oh, antiseptic is, uh... Healing balm, yes. Okay, now we're good. Bam. Smack. 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 Come on. I'll take you all down. Hold on, time out, I need to heal. Okay, now we're good. Just keep healing and whacking, healing and whacking. Hey, shut, hey, stop it, I'm trying to heal. Ow, damn it. Oh, no. Uh -huh. Finally happened. Yeah, 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 yeah. I turned permadeath off, though, as far as I'm aware, so that should, uh, I should be fine. It's not that it was really, it's not that it was too hard. It's more like, I think what happened was I got outnumbered really bad and overwhelmed because there was, like, 50 of them and one of me <laughs> so but yeah even on um even on easy they do they do major damage when they hit you and that's because the game this is this game isn't really meant to be combat oriented it's more like combat is like a last resort when you when you really need it you know stealth is the main objective here and i did not do the stealth correctly <laughs> no sir thank god i turned permadeath off though how did i get back here well, you see, it's because I turned off permadeath. So, uh, yeah. So we're all we're, we're good, Arthur. We're good. Permadeath is one of the dumbest mechanics in video games anyways. I understand why some people enjoy it, but that ain't for me. Okay, so you I see how it is now. You use the down button on the D-pad to switch between throwing items like glass bottles, rocks, caltrops, and darts. Uh, right on the D-pad switches between food. Up on the D-pad switches between healing items. I don't know what left is for. So it's not like you equip them. It's okay. I see now. Oop. All right, let's see here. How? What's the best way to go about this? First, let's take this guy down since he's up here by himself. Yeah. Okay, so there's that. Footprints, that's nice. I can see them through the walls, see where they are. Oh, I can aim it. Yeah. Over there. Yeah, why don't you go investigate that and leave me the hell alone? Or not. What was that? 
Ooh, ooh, I have an idea. Since I'm concealed and all. What the fuck was that? Why don't you come find out? Come on. Lame. Get over here and investigate. So I can do this. It's nothing personal. Thank you. Why are you up on the wall? What the hell? You gotta go find out what that was, don't you, buddy? A uh oh. Home is his castle. Um. It's not your bleeding castle. Um. Um. Oops. Don't come back. Oh, that's all I had to do? Was just go behind a box? Okay. Well, that's. I keep forgetting I am playing on easy. Their alert system is down severely because of that. It's okay. I. Ooh. Arthur found himself in this situation by not taking his joy, and he was exposed because he saw the piñata that they were busting open as it really was, a dead rat, and his friends realized that he was off his joy. They labeled him a downer, and they were like, Get him! Ah! You know. The village people. That's right, go investigate, damn you. We're and not bloody bed and breakfast, are we? Screw it. This'll be Whoa! Whoa! This'll be easier when I'm not going up against twenty people at once. Come on, you want some too? Can't we All just right. Agree to disagree. Nope, it's too late for that. We killed him. I'm pretty sure we killed him. We didn't knock him out. We killed him because this is a shovel. So you gotta hold the button down to search first, and then after you've already searched them, you gotta press it again to actually grab the items. And searching corpses does make noise. Okay. Now I know there are more of you assholes in here. No one saw me hide. I bet I could stay here forever. At least until I starved to death. Yeah, he totally didn't see me with the headlamp on. Come on. Oh, you saw your friend's corpse, didn't you? Yeah, sorry about that, but here. Oh, please just lie down. I have a bad habit of leaving a trail of evidence behind me. But you know what? I just can't be screwed to take the time necessary to... Hmm. It was the boogie man. Who do you think? Please don't make a fuss. I'm really getting into this. I mean, I know it was good based off of the beginning. I mean, it's got some, it's got some flaws, yeah. But what video game doesn't, honestly? I am enjoying it, though. Not even going to lie. I cannot front. This... This is fun. This is, like, stupid fun. You know what I mean? Like, some games... Some games are, like fun in the sense of like a very well thought out narrative you know um stuff like that and mechanics and some games are just stupid fun like stupid go nuts and do a bunch of crazy shit fun oh 
now. I, I imagine that tickled just a tiny bit. Ah, oh, that's how I get down. Right. Huh. I need to I watch to find the tracks and walk Altered Carbon. I need to watch Altered Carbon. I've heard about it. I haven't, uh... Haven't had the pleasure of checking it out yet, though. Ooh, dear darling Sebastian. I'll take that. Thank you. Guess that was just for that, since you ah, pick up all these notes. Part storage. Oh. I like how you have, like, really, really ridiculously long reach, by the way. Like, because you can pick up items from a decently far away amount. Ooh. Play a note or play a chord. Ah, let's go all Beethoven up in here. Ah, that's beautiful music, isn't it? No. It's awful. That piano sounds like it's really out of tune. Anybody in here? I'm not gonna sneak if there's not anyone to sneak past. Imagine this uh, goes right here, and... Oh, it's a puzzle. When unlocking trackside doors, always do be careful. Well, that's an easy answer right there. A, D, B, C. I don't imagine they'll all be that easy, but... Uh, a, D, B, C. Yay! Fourth grade level puzzles for the win. Oh. Oh. <sighs> All right. I think we're in the train station, right? But like... Ooh, more flashbacks. Something about Arthur's past, I'm telling you. Something I'm happened. I'm so sorry, Percy. I should have got on the train with you, like I promised. Who is Percy, the though? A brother? If a kid was a day over 13, what could I do? You could have kept your mouth shut, Arthur, and not told them you were 13. That's what you could have done. Ah. Requires... Oh. Eh, yeah, yeah. I'll take the money. Four sovereigns. Cool. Um, ah. And are we back up in the normal train station? Coin box. Come on. Come on. Yeah, there we are. Ooh, ten sovereigns. What are the sovereigns good for, though? What am I really gonna buy, and from who? In this place. I guess we'll find out eventually. All right. If you guys could be so kind as to give me, like, two minutes. I have to use the bathroom really, really bad. I've been trying to hold it so that I don't interrupt this, but I just can't anymore. I'm sorry. I'll be back extremely quickly, I promise. I'm back, folks. See, I told you it wouldn't be very long. I'm actually uh, <clears throat> gonna make another drink real quick, which is a bad idea, because that's the whole reason I'd use the bathroom in the first place. Stuff just runs right through me. All right. But if you've never had rum mixed with cream soda, I'm telling you, it's the definitive mix. <sighs> cream soda is one of the best mixers for rum. Ooh, I'm gonna save real quick, too, just to be 
safe. Okay. I feel better now. Oop, damn. Isn't this where I just came? Oh no, this is where I need to go. Crap, there was more stuff in there I could have explored, and now it's too late. Damn it, there was a door to the left. Ah, oh well. Oop. Yes, I have. To go to Germany, are you I have seen Infinity War. Uh, Frost and Fist, where'd they go? Oh, okay. I was wondering if you were still here, Mythos, but um. Ten days too old, but we don't make the rules anymore, Mr. Hastings. Thanks for joining. Thanks for watching. As long as you did, I hope you enjoyed it. No, I did. Should have just kept quiet and got on the train. And uh, if you want to see, I'll be going for about another half hour, so if you want to see the rest of this episode, you can um, watch the archive later, since you were here for most of it anyways. But yeah, just a little FYI for those who don't hell? know. There's been some sort of caving. I'm sure most of you do, Someone's but... For walking down the train tracks to the Britannia Bridge. What this is going... What do I do now? This is going to be a weekly thing. Oh, look! It's a little lost lamb. Ah, crap. Where's Bo Peep? In your curtsy way, I bet. <laughs> That's little Miss Muppet, you Muppet. <laughs> uh, 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 can we pound him now? Yep. So mm, nope. <laughs> oh, crap. It requires a pick. Uh, excuse me, gentlemen. <laughs> Oh, I, I appear to have... I appear to be stuck in the scenery. It appears that I am actually, like, waist-deep in the ground right now. Um... Well, it's a good thing I just saved, isn't it? Good God. I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to load the game that I just saved. I hate when that stuff happens. This game needs... This game needs patched really bad. It's still extremely buggy. <laughs> thank you for watching, Nikki. Um, um, thank you for watching, Nikki. And uh, same goes for you as well. I'll be going for another half hour, so if you want to catch what you missed, you can watch the last half hour of the archive later on. <clears throat> Come on, okay. Yes, I'm ready to load my previous save game. It's kind of what I wanted. <laughs> well, I mean, overall and oversoul, it still works. Either way. But yeah, what I was trying to say, now we got a load screen, it'll be good. This is gonna be a weekly thing. I'm gonna live stream this game every Thursday, same time, same place, until we finish it. And we actually seem to be kind of uh, chugging along through the... Um, <laughs> we we seem to be kind of chugging along through the narrative. Oh, I'm sorry. I hope I'm not putting you to sleep. Or the game isn't. I know that's not the case. I know. It's, it's, you're tired from where I know you work hard and a lot, so. But, uh, I try to be entertaining as I possibly can, I swear. And, and I'm trying to see... Okay. Ah. Damn these load screens. I don't know if they can honestly do anything about the load times, you know? I mean, there are some games with faster load times, but they're usually first party. They're more optimized. <laughs> um. But, uh... But they, this game could use a patch for the bugs, like falling through the scenery, clipping through the scenery, stuff like that, you know? The combat is a little bit wonky, too. I wish... I mean, I like it, but I wish it was more focused. You know what I mean? Like, I wish that there was maybe, like, a lock-on system or something, because sometimes it feels like you're just flailing wildly at the air, hoping you hit something, you know what I mean? And no, this game is not PS4 Pro optimized, as far as I can tell, and it doesn't seem like boost mode really makes a huge difference, either. Empty pill bottle, pick up, desk, take the desk, search. Oh, 
I, it's a good, th I, I missed some of this stuff. Where? Oh, crap. Do I really have to go through this part again? Oh, no, I don't. It's just... Okay, so that kind of sucks. When you save your game, it does not load you in the exact spot you were standing when you saved. Instead, it loads you at the checkpoint spot, the respawn point of that particular area. Kind of ass, but I, but it looks like it. everything that I searched and collected stayed, though, so that's nice. It's just that movement-wise... Oh, it's jammed anyways. I didn't miss anything. It looks like movement-wise, though... It pushes you back a little bit progress-wise, which is slightly annoying, but not completely game-breaking. Oh, what was that? Lockpick! I missed those last time, damn! Three of them, even! Definitely gonna want those. And the bobbies are here waiting for me, too! Alright, let's go, you bleeding bastards. Can I hit you with a rock? I can! Ha! Alright, let's go. Smack, smack, and wallop. Look, I don't even want to be here. My turn. Is that a croquet? Uh, is that a... I've always liked you, actually. Not a croquet mallet, but like a, a, a cricket bat, or whatever the hell they call them. Why is it so dark in here? Can I fix that? Where are the ops? Where are the... Where's the... Where's the... Where is the bloody brightness option? Damn it all to hell. Um... I don't see one. I don't see a brightness option. Okay. Nope, I don't see a brightness option. What have we come to? Well, that sucks. Oh, what am I doing? I should be searching their corpses if I can actually see them. Ah, uh, there's the... Ah, there we are. At least they highlight when you get near them. That's useful. I'll have to play around with this a bit more before the next episode and uh, see if I can't figure out how to fix the brightness and such. It's difficult... When you're doing a live stream instead of pre-recorded, you can't cut out the stuff that you want to cut out. Like earlier, when it took me forever to figure out how to get inside that fortress, I would have trimmed the shit out of that <laughs> if this was pre-recorded. But this is a AAA kind of lengthy game, so I don't want to, um... Hey, Corn Puff! You are here... Well... You're here for what is essentially the last half hour of, of, my, of uh, my playthrough this time, but could join us. It means a lot to me. I really appreciate it. Been a while since I've seen you around here. Uh. But, but, the stream will be archived after it's over, so if you want to go back and watch it from the beginning, you can. And also, this is going to be a weekly thing. Every Thursday at 7 p.m. Central, I will be doing this. Yes, a lead pipe! Now that's a weapon. So yeah, every Thursday, 7 p.m. Central Time, for two hours from 7 to 9, I'll be playing this until we finished it, until we get through the whole thing. And just get a coin box. You missed some really good stuff, but you did say that you've seen other playthroughs of this before, so I think you've seen, you know, the beginning of this already. You know, with the pinata, that's the rat, and stuff like that. Unless you've only watched Early Access versions, be because this is the full official version, which is different from the Early Access versions. They changed a lot. It's more narrative focused now, and a little bit easier. And you can turn off permadeath, which is nice. Okay, though that's where I need to go, but what's over here? Oh, another one of these. But hey, it's if you if you can't make it, and this goes for everybody. I, I have no qualms against that. I'm not one of those people that wants to. I used to be really bad about shoving my videos down people's throat, and I I I have gotten over that behavior. Bloody hell! That's now, I I want this to be a. F Ollie, a f come from me, have you? Ollie, I'm Arthur. You I'm your friend. You won't get me. You won't get me, you bastard. Ollie, I, no. 
It's Arthur! Bloody this is the guy from the, the trailer. Are you go mental! I'll save you, Margaret! I'm your old neighbor, Artie! Always lying! Little Artie! Artie's gone! They took him away! Ollie, no! They You're didn't! You're lying! You're a waste of... No! Ollie, it's Arthur! Well, why didn't you see that before? Oh, well, thank you. That means a lot to me. I'm, I'm glad that he... Oh, my God, Artie. It's... Little Artie. Yeah, for fuck's sake. Watch your mouth, laddie. What would your mum think? <laughs> I thought they took you away. It's no, crazy. They had my birthday wrong. What? Sorry? Eh. No, of course not. No, you've got it all wrong. That was Jack turned you in, and I what tried to save you. Right. It's crazy I and a little surreal, now. honestly. You came back from the station. To know that people the enjoy my one. content so much. You don't think they hurt him, Percy? The Germans aren't animals, you know. They just wanted to make sure we stay quiet. And we did. Spotted there are... Uh, that's very kind of you. I I'm not thirsty. That's right, Margaret. We have to run after water. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's got the, uh, the hermit crazies. Any idea where he might be after all these years? Not really. I know I have to get out of Wellington Wells. I, th I thought I could take the train tracks to the bridge. Hi. The only way to the Britannia Bridge is the train station and the parade. And good luck getting into the parade. You could stay here. Remember when you and Sally... To be honest, there are some people who watch me... It's young Artie! Meg, you because remember Artie, they don't think you? they're doing me a favor. They might be friends or for young uh, people I know, but it's not exactly oh. the, what I'm doing right. on YouTube isn't exactly their right. the thing that they would Sorry. watch a lot of normally. Margaret says it's but best if I keep they to still myself. want to support oh. me, so they'll like throw the videos Sorry, on in the background or something but when they're doing something else, so that I still Margaret get the, the watch time help and stuff. Each other. Really. Brilliant. There's a I appreciate it. The old German camp. But I we could definitely it. appreciate it more when people camp. are actually watching. Where watching. all those home army chaps run around practicing stabbing people with bayonets? What, what do you want me to do there? Run around yelling, here I am, shoot me, while you go in under the wire? Well, I'm not going to make fun uh, of the accents thing or anything. I need from their what, they're British. What's, what's, what's so funny about if that? Help me, I'll I mean, British people are funny, wells. but... <laughs> I just need you to turn off the power in the camp. Oh, of and course. This isn't going to get me killed. Don't be a great girl's blouse. I'll meet you at the bunker after dark. Don't All worry right. about the sentries on the bridge. I'm well, going to call this guy Shrek. Good night sleep. This is Shrek. Me. I know what I'm doing. So Hello, Christina. Building. How are you doing? Ollie? I don't actually oh, know the way out, you know. It's unfortunate, like... A lot of times people show up right when I'm getting close to the end of my stream. Makes me want to actually keep going longer, but I don't want the archive to be too long. And I need some time to, to unwind and stuff before the Margaret. night's over, you know? What's her name? She was supposed to go on the train, but then she disappeared and no one would talk about it. Oh. Let's see. Glass bottle, I'll take. Can I have the hammer? No? Aw, looks like it could be a weapon. Or at the very least, you could throw it at someone, you know? Bonk them upside the head. Watch it go whoosh, 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 clunk. Just like the rocks and stuff. Okay, so that's the way out. But hold on, let me let me just see, because you know me. I like to... Gotta have the stuff. Gotta loot my, gotta loot my items. If you've watched Bioshock or Dead Space, you already know. You already know how I do. All right, looks like we're going to have to go do something. I mean, that's pretty much the, the point of any game. Do things. Go to the place, do the thing. Hit the stuff. Kill the people. Ah, oh, pretty butterflies coming out of the tree. Is there anything in that tree? Oh, ow. Oh, those are bees. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought they were butterflies. That's not good. Oh, Jesus, I've been... I pissed them off. I should not have done that. They did say Curiosity killed the cat. And here's the reason why I don't want to explore. Because 
This game punishes you for exploring. You see what just happened? Don't go off the beaten path, you might get stung. Uh. Of course I'm trespassing. Is there anywhere in this game I'm not trespassing? Are you asleep? It looks like he's asleep. Good. Can use that to my advantage. What does this button do? Open gate. Okay. It's gonna pick the lock real quick, sneak our way into this building here. I'll take your bandages because I can probably use those to craft healing items. Yeah, I don't care about stealing from the bobbies. Not at all. It's the civilians I don't want to steal from. Alright, so that is not how I get in there. How do I get in there? It must be from a door further inside. Hello? Bobby boys? Ah, someone's in here. Now you two bloody listen to me, alright? One fine day, the sea boys come running into the regimental HQ saying there's an elephant broke loose. Now, elephants is very gentle creatures most of the time. And they okay. get along just fine with their man who rides them. He's called Umber. Um, but oof. When they're in a when you're trying to be stealthy, sometimes it makes me not even want to talk in real life because I'm afraid I might. Exactly the wrong direction. And the elephant runs into the market and starts eating peaches. And the coolie tries to stop him. And the elephant steps on him suddenly. Picking locks makes noise, but as you can see by the speaker icon only having one audio wave coming out of it, it's not loud. It's very low noise. Are you sleeping? Or are you dead? Okay. This guy has a gun. I'm gonna have to be very careful about this. What is with the? Is everyone dead or sleeping? I'm I'm so confused here. His eyes are open. He's dead, I think, or he's just really really high on joy. No fucking oh, civilians! Shit. Yeah. I have to kill you now. Oh, just, <laughs> better not let anyone see me out of uniform. Oh boy. Out of uniform? Oh, so I can steal a guard's uniform and fit in? Can I steal it off this guy? Of course not. Let's, uh. He must have been really drunk or something. Ah, uh, here we go. This will take me up here. Okay. Oh! That is not what I wanted to do. <laughs> uh, I like how climbing the ladder doesn't make any noise, even though you can clearly hear it clink, clonk, clink, clank. Uh, oh. Uh, I was hoping I could get out on the rooftops, but I guess not. Instead, I'll just break my ankles, I suppose. Can I climb up here? Ugh. If this was any other game, I'd be able to. I wish I could get in here, because that's where all the fun stuff is. But this door is jammed. Probably got to bust it open. Probably not worth it. I heard... I, I saw something. Oh, okay. All right. Is this entire area just trespassing? This whole... Yeah, it is, because it's like a military base, isn't it? I need a uniform so I can blend in, apparently. Hitman style. Wear a disguise. Well, I'm definitely not going through the front door. That's just stupid. Let us see ya. Yeah. Going towards the bunker. Oh, look. 
A nice, toasty, warm fire. Search campfire. Won't that alley? I guess not. Uh. Ah, here we go. The bunker is decent, vey. But hold up. I see... Ah! A flashback collectible. Up a tree. It's a collectible! Why is it stealing? That's the bee tree. Arthur! Arthur? You get down from that tree before I chop it down. Do you know why they're registering us? The Germans love their lists, that's all. They're taking us away on a train to Germany. You know about it, don't you? Who told you that? It's ridiculous. Oh, oh, you all know about it, just not the kids. Look, they've got cows there. It's not going to be powdered milk. They might even have chocolate. Oh, chocolate Ooh. makes it all better. They've got tanks, Arthur. Why haven't you noticed? How are we supposed to argue with tanks? I don't want to go to Germany. It's only for a little while. I think. I don't I think. want to be a hostage. Calm down. Let's have some tea. <laughs> oh, right. I'll, I'll come down. Typical British. Tea makes everything better. Um, I think I might be stuck, actually. <laughs> You can get up, but you can't get down, huh? Just like a cat, you have a little bit of trouble. It's jammed. It's not jammed. It's a lock. I could honest. I could pick that, but I don't want to go in there. Obviously, that would be all kinds of bad. Have the entire Bobby Force after me. I'm supposed to go in the bunker, I believe. Seems like the right way to go. <sighs> Let's just take a brief. Moment to see what's over here. I should stop doing that. I'm actually losing health every time I do that. Oh, okay. You can't see me. I'm in. Oh, that's not concealed. Hey, buddy, buddy. I need a. I need a uniform. Can you help me out? Can you spare yours? You know, for being a trained soldier, you're not very, uh... No, 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 please don't struggle. You're not very, um... Ah, what's the word? Alert of the fact that I'm sneaking up behind you? Air raid shelter. Can't get in there. No opening. What if we just jump off the cliff into the water and say screw everything? We've had it with this place. Okay, uh, I think I can actually maybe craft uh, the suit that I need. Nope. Unless it's the proper suit. That's not going to make a difference, though. Alright, screw it. Straight to the bunker, then. No more time wasting. And as soon as, uh, within the next 15 minutes or so, we'll probably stop this when I find a good stopping point. Not yet, but soon. Oh, wait, how did you get here before me? I left ages before you did. Do you or ever did wonder I? why the Germans didn't take their tanks with them when they left? I've made a map. There's a hole in the fence inside the dump. You just have to get in here, get the key, and cut the power. Then... Sneak out into the darkness while I rob them blind. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. How do I or so you power? say. The general keeps the keys in his desk. You want me to break into the general's office? Anyway, you can scotch the power that's fine by me, lad. I'll meet you back at the train station. What if they spot me? I'd run. They don't have a lot of ammunition, but they're terribly handy with their bayonets. That's your plan B? Run? Well, you could ask them for some of their famous hot buttered crumpets, but I wouldn't recommend it. They can't run very fast. They're all old farts, like me. Neither can I, though. I can sprint for like 10 seconds before I get winded. Because of the stamina bar. 
Speaking of which, do I have... Oh, I have eight upgrade points. I should probably uh, do something about that. All right, what I got here? Heal better. Yes. Unburdened. You can carry more and being overburdened slows you less. Oh, that cost eight. Damn. Wow, they cost a lot. Body snatcher, search and carry bodies faster, drop bodies quickly. Smooth talker. Talking to people makes them trust you more. Hmm. <laughs> in the in the example, he shoves the cop, and he's like, "Hey, what you doing?" And he's like, "Hey, how you doing?" Hey, and he's like, "Oh, okay, good day to you, sir." <laughs> okay. Uh, notice footsteps from further away. Unarmed hits to the head have a chance to stagger the enemy. With a little preparation, you can give someone a real wallop. Oh, upgrade my health. That's what I'm gonna do. Oh, because you end up playing as three different characters throughout this game, right? So it looks like. Arthur has his own personal upgrades as well. Odd man out, defensive and sarcastic. English repressed. Swift runs quite fast. Yeah, he runs fast, but not for very long. Unremarkable. Can hide in plain sight. Oh, okay, so that's an ability specific to him. Well, Ollie, let's see that map you made. Oh, Ollie's sleeping potion for those chaps on the bridge. Okay, so that, um, interesting. I like the idea of that. Holly said there was a hole in the fence in the dump. That sounds much safer than walking in by the front gate. Wouldn't, yeah, I agree. Uh, oh, this is where I was going to go before. We will silently pick the lock. Thank you. Open. Conceal. Oh, now there's searchlights I'm going to have to look out for. How fun. How... Oh, force open the crate. Yeah, I'll take all... Take all that. All right, there's a hole in the fence. He said there's a hole in the fence somewhere. I don't think I need to sneak quite yet. Oh, yes, I do. <laughs> Yes, I do. Oh boy. Oh, no, nope. wrong button. Wrong button, I said. Damn it. A banger. What does that do? It's a nail bomb. Oh, that's rough. Sneaky bastard. He kind of got found you. Got him. Now we see the violence inherent in the system. Yeah, yeah, I mentioned that earlier before you showed up. This game is basically Bioshock, Dishonored, The Last of Us, Assassin's Creed, and Skyrim all mixed into one. There's elements of all of them. But Bioshock and Dishonored are the most prominent aspects. Let's drink some water real quick. Make sure we're all good on that. Steal these darts. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And thank you. All right. I don't have a record to play on here. Ah, you can play records to draw people's attention. That makes sense. Happy, happy noisemaker. Ah, this is how I get up there. Good, good, good All stuff. Right. Here goes. Oof. No. Ow. It is a full... The game is a full price. The train station. We yeah, that no. Germany because of papier mache. Yeah, it is a full price sixty dollar triple A game. Yeah, triple A games are almost always sixty dollars. The big, the big budgets, you know, the big blockbuster games. It's not an indie. Indies are the cheaper ones. But that being said, there's only about two minutes left, so I think this is going to be a good stopping point, because we're in a new area, and I don't want to overdo it here in case... I don't want to 
start searching around this area in case I get in the middle of a bunch of catastrophe and stuff. I don't want to run overtime. I'm about uh, ready. <laughs> I like how you say yikes, but like majority of the video games that come out are $60. But from what I've seen on your channel, you're not used to playing like big budget, big name games. You play a lot of indies, so you're used to the cheaper stuff. But no, you know, stuff like... Uh, Uncharted, God of War, Halo, Gears of War, Assassin's Creed, Bioshock, games like that, those are all, when they first came out, they were all $60, you know, because big AAA, big budget games usually are, you know, because they're, there's a lot that goes into them. Uh, but that doesn't necessarily mean that they're always good, though. There are actually some indie games that are a lot better than some AAA games, not even going to lie. Like, I would rather play Journey than Call of Duty any day. <laughs> but... I think I'm going to go ahead and call it quits um, here. Yeah, I, I highly recommend getting into some of those larger titles, by the way, because some of them are really good. Like Resident Evil 7 was a really good horror game. That's a big name title. Uh, Bioshock's really good, you know, stuff like that. But um, some of them come out on, some of them come out, some of them are exclusives to different platforms. Like God of War is a PlayStation exclusive. Halo is an Xbox exclusive, that kind of thing. But... Uh, a lot of them are also on the PC, which is where I think you play most of your games. A lot of the multi-platform ones are also on PC. Like, if you've never played Bioshock, play that. It's on PC. That is one of the best games ever made. And it's not $60 anymore. It's cheap. You could probably get it for, like, 20 to 40 now, maybe? I don't know how much it is on Steam, but it's definitely not full price anymore. Resident Evil 7 in VR is the best way to play it. It is absolutely one of the best VR experiences I have ever had. The immersion is so real. But anyways, uh, Moss is another really good PSVR exclusive. Came out earlier this year. But anyways, um, yeah, get yourself the Bioshock Collection. Play them all. Really, really fantastic games. Amazing story. If you like the look of this, you would like Bioshock. Trust me. But that's going to be it for this live stream. Um... <laughs> for Psychopaths. It is honestly uh, Resident Evil 7 VR. I think the word you're looking for is masochists, people who enjoy punishment. But no, it is, it's the, if you like horror, it is the best horror experience you could ever possibly have. I actually, when I was playing that game, I felt like I was actually in that mansion and I could eventually navigate it as easily as my own home. You know, I got to the feel the layout of it like the back of my hand. But, um, yeah, anyways, this is the, uh, <sighs> And Bioshock is kind of like this. It's dystopian, takes place in the same era, 1964, but it takes place in an underwater place, uh, an, an underwater city, a city that was built underwater that went to hell. So it's got some minor horror vibes, but it's not a horror game. You know, there are some elements of horror to it, but it's actually more of like a sci-fi first-person shooter uh, with similar elements to this one. And you also get power, like you can shoot lightning out of your hands like Darth Sidious. Uh, so that's pretty cool. All right, so that'll be it for this live stream. I hope you guys enjoyed it because it's now a little bit after 9, so I'm going to end it here. Thank you all so much for everyone who is here for watching, both those of you who were here from the beginning and those of you who joined later and came in and watched. I appreciate all of you equally, and uh, I hope to see you at the same time, same place, next Thursday to continue this crazy adventure. And also, if you have not seen them yet, Reactions and Highlights 14 is out. The, the original skit this time is related to Kingdom Hearts. I built my own organization 13. Some funny moments from games I recently played. And also, the latest episode of Bloodborne came out yesterday. I let Funky Heroes do all the editing again. If you enjoy laughing, if you enjoy memes and laughter, I highly, highly recommend watching that. It is hilarious. Maybe not as funny as the last one, but still pretty funny. So anyways... And yes, this will be once a week every Thursday at 7 p.m. because it has to be squeezed in between my normal upload schedule, you know, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. This is like, think of this as like a bonus or an add-on to my normal schedule, you know, like bonus content, like DLC. <laughs> this is a DLC play. Anyways, um, anyways, um... Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, for those of you who are watching the archive, let me know what you think in the comments down below. And as usual, I will catch you possibly on another day, definitely yet another time, and likely in another video. Okay, goodbye!